and welcome to part 17 of Yes, Your Grace, 17 parts, and we are still going. We just finished up with the Lords, and we've already found out that a new person wants to marry Asalia now, so we got that, plus we need to rebuild our army because Atana, Ivo, that ass, is bringing his army in to take us out in about 19 weeks, so we got to prepare for that. We have a lot. We're going to need lots of money. We're going to need lots of supplies. We're going to need a lot of everything. And the first thing we're going to do is we just had a painting given to us. You grace. I have another painting for you. The Battle for Brianna. Take a look at this one. Fabulous. I will take it. 18 pieces of gold. Is that all right? That's a six gold, that's six gold profit, so. That's good for me. I'm fine with that. Lady Ada told me what you were doing with those paintings. You lied to me. You're not a collector. Eric, I can fully explain. These people, uh, these works people buy are not truly art. They are nothing but fraud. These paintings do not retract, reflect true natures of the subject. They've been painted without a reference. Art, artists call them imperfectionists. In reality, they just can't paint. My art shows each subject in their pursued, purest state. These artists only exaggerate features by making them look better. This devalues my work. So I just dispose of the paintings. I pay for the paintings, so I can do whatever I with them I wish. I choose to burn them. So what? It harms no one. Fair enough. I guess you're right. As long as you pay for the artworks. Of course I do. I pay premium prices too. That's all. And I mean, right now we need money, so we might have to go and start pulling down all the art in our kingdom. Just to start reinforcing everything. Well, this is the one we sent out. Your, your grace, you've called for me. Will you join my army in an upcoming battle? We have no chance of, to win the war, but my army needs you. Your grace. Most people in our village took their children and ran away in fear of Babushka coming for them. The village is under, was, was under great depression. We have left too. We were only visiting to retrieve our things when your agent called. I'm sorry about your children. Oh, it was the that was the person from the last part who said her children got taken, so they moved out. Okay. I told the villagers you wanted to see them regarding the call to arms. They should be here shortly. Your Grace, Torlando made me uh, bring a stuffed monster head to his house. I'm not sure what he was going on about, but I'm glad to be away from that freak. Yo, Grace, blessings, you bless you from all the existing gods. You're truly a savior. I owe you my life. My wife was taking me back, and it's the luckiest day of my life. I don't have much to offer here but a sack of potatoes. Thank you, Bugoslav. I hope you and your wife are happy. I'll just put this with the rest of my supplies. For, for the past couple of days, weird noises and humming has been coming from the well. Who? Boo! Hey! Hey! At first we thought someone was playing a trick on us, but no one could survive in the well for almost a week. It could be Vodnoy. Perhaps he got bored sitting in the lakes and he moved to the well. Maybe he's hungry. Perhaps he wants a little company. We're not sure, but we'd rather not get close to that well. We've been hearing, uh, we've been going to the river to collect water, but it's a chore. Ah, uh, let's send a witch. So these creatures are no joke. To be safe, we best chase it back to the lakes okay. using magic. Thank you, Your Grace. It'll be over before you know it. The trips to the river are really tiring. Your Grace! The butcher in my village keeps throwing bits of leftovers on the path. It rots and smells. I can't sleep because I get a headache from the strong smell. God knows what disease this pile of rotten meat holds. Please, your grace, can you help? Send the general. My general will talk to the butcher. Thank you, your grace. I can finally sleep now. The neighbors are going to be glad to hear of this. I should have come here a long time ago. So, let's see. So, where was the guy? There was a guy here in one of the villages. Who just came through. Cult of trees we can probably bring in. Let's bring the hunter to complete the tasks. What? 
Do I not have a hunter? Oh, everyone's gone. Okay. Well, I guess we don't, uh, we can't do that today. Um, maybe, yeah, let's see if we can sell some of the other art we can find around the chamber. The Grey Mountains. I wonder if it's going to end up making my wife upset. That, uh, I'm going to just take all the art and live in a barren castle walls. So let's see if we can, uh, get some of this stuff. Um, council chamber. I'm sure there's more art in here we can sell. Or maybe not. What about the dungeon? Of course there's no art in the dungeon. What am I thinking? Greco, come back over. We need the money. So, yeah, that kind of wraps up this week then. Uh, so let's go into the next week. We got to start putting supplies in here as well. We need at least five crates of supplies. And look, our army upkeep is becoming so big now that uh, it's going to start uh, start affecting us. So let's see. What can we do? We got 87 gold. We've reinforced the walls. Ballista provides defense against siege towers. Uh, let's Let's go with the ballista. I wonder if maybe I'll do that and I'll get the mining equipment first. Because maybe we'll be able to mine up some, like, better weapons eventually. Grievno, week 34. The General. Your Grace. I tried talking to the Butcher. He didn't really want to listen to me. He insisted he wanted to come and see you. You should expect him soon. Your Grace, I've helped out the villager who had problems with the rabbits. They shouldn't cause any more problems. Hey, right, where's the butcher? Greco, I got some stuff for you. Yeah, okay, I got another painting for you. Oh, yeah, he wanted the stork painting, that's right. 18 pieces of gold? You got it, dude. That's all I have. Bye, Greco. Now, which one is the painter? Peasant, merchant, peasant, peasant. Maybe he's not coming. Your grace, your hunter taught my family how to trap rabbits. We can hunt and grow more than food than we can for ourselves. We'll even have enough to sell. Here, please accept this as our thanks. Nice. Money's always going to be... I'm selling packs of supplies, your grace. Let me help you with your struggle. I offer the best price in all of Davern. Only 28 gold and 22 supplies. What is it that he's selling? Supplies? Oh, 28 gold for 22 supplies. I wonder what we can do with all this oracle dust. I don't know. I don't know what we can do with it. Yeah, come back around later. Was I supposed to give, like, the oracle dust to Lurs or something? My lord, we seek shelter. Our village is entirely destroyed. We have no place left to go, no place to call home. Can you help us? It's your grace. What happened to your village? Uh, Brinsk, my lord. I never heard of such a village. Must be awfully far away behind the mountains. Yes, my lord. Redovians, eh? My lord, my grace, your grace. We realize who you are. We realize our brothers fought with you. We realize we are not welcomed here, but we had no other choice. Many have died, and many more don't need to die. I urge you, I beg you, help us. We have no weapons nor bad intentions. We simply want to live. Uh, why did you... Why leave Rodovia? One born in riches and wealth will never understand what it's like to struggle. Our home country is at war. Many fight for resources, for power. We followed Baron. He's a good man. He's bound to marry one of the daughters from the Seven Kingdoms, once that takes place. Us and you will not differ. Until then, we just need a place to stay. Your people killed our brothers. Unarmed, you say? I've just returned from a battle with your king. 
I marched to meet him with an army, but returned with a few men. We are at war. Why would we help you? We do not want this fight, nor how to defend ourselves. Baron did all he could as to help get as many as us through as possible. The rest of us are stuck behind the mountain trail. We are not who you think we are. We came here to seek peace. Lies. Or not, I cannot help you. There's a couple of dozen of us, women and children. We just want a place to stay. We have nowhere else to go. There must be something you can do. Your Grace, you should think should we help them or not. You should keep in mind that King Yerdik will only aid us with his army if we refuse all requests from Adovia. On the other hand, Cab King Fabion will aid us if we help all Redovians. Oh, do we get rid of them or do we support them? That's the big. That's going to be the big twist of fate here. I really feel bad about leaving them though, so we'll feed you. Uh, <sighs> fine. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You'll get food and supplies. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tell your children they will eat tonight. Ooh, Thank you, Your Grace. Oh, nice As a token of our gratitude, please accept this gift. We call them fire flowers. We use these things for uh, for celebration. Children love these things, but in large quantity, it would be it proved to be useful on the battlefield as well. Perhaps it could be practical in your future struggles. Well, I guess we're not getting help from that other king. Your Grace, I have a vicious stomachache. For five days, there's no sign of a uh, stool. My eld mother prepared a prune juice, a special mixture. It didn't work. Actually, it's worse since then. If I didn't know any better, I would think that she wants to put an end to me. I think constipation is the terms medics use. Help a poor fellow out, won't you? Go find a healer. Don't bother me with such petty matters. Visit a healer. I'm sure they would help. They cost money, your grace. All I have is two chickens. The house is my mother's. I'd have to wait until she passes away to get her things. I mean, we need the money, though, but take this gold. And then when your mother passes, we own claim to the house and we will sell it. I'm a monster. Alright, let's talk to the wife. Darling. During the King's Summit, King Fabiorni asked me to help people from Rodovia. He was clear he will join our forces if we do so. On the other hand, King Yedrick said he would help if I'd exterminate them all. That's great, honey. It means we'll get help either way. Yes, I suppose. Some Rodovians have visited our halls this week. They asked for food and supplies. I decided to help them. Oh, do you remember not what those bandits have done to us? We lost many people. And you're giving them supplies? They're peasants. They have nowhere to go. I won't carry on war between us and Rodovia. We must help each other out. Well, it's your decision, sweetheart. Now you have to help them all. I know, honey. And that's the end of, uh... Oh, what's this? Oh, I got a couple of people I can send out. Okay. So, let's send out our witch then. And talk to these people. Because we helped them out before. Oh, wait, no, I don't have the witch. Let's send the general out. And... Because there was a few people we tried to help. Problems. Village on fire. Hanzo. Flooded village. Poverty. Fever in the village. Lost beloved son. Gold for boots. I know this guy. The stomachache guy we gave help for. So hopefully he gets fixed. The side business. I think we can call in this guy. I have a feeling because we had to refuse a lot of these people when we were preparing for the last war. They might not be willing to help us out with this upcoming one. So got to really start thinking about this as well. Plus they were paying out. The butt for our three people here. We're paying what? 31 gold and we're making 25, 26, 31, 34, 35 gold. And we pay for spices as well. So 
I don't know. It's going to be really difficult in the next little while, especially with our forces building up again. But we got everything. Supplies are going to be okay. We got to eventually look at figuring out a way to uh, get this stuff. I'm, I don't want to take out another loan, but we also need to start getting better taxes and more in with our taxes too. So that's the end of part 17. We'll start on part 18. Coming up in two days. Thank you again as we kick off another part in moments. Thank you again for your support. Hit the subscribe button. We will see you in part 18. 18! Yes, we're at 18. Hit me up on my socials as well, at the Deadman2DX on Twitter, and the Deadman2DX on Twitch.